Coca-Cola, or Coke, is well known for protecting its secret formula and famously keeps its recipe locked in a vault. In Coca-Cola Bottling Company versus Coca-Cola, we'll see whether a court could enter a default judgment against Coke after it refused to reveal its secret formula during discovery. Coke had contracts with multiple bottling companies, known as bottlers. Under the contracts, Coke would sell its syrups to bottlers, and then the bottlers would create Coke products. In 1983, the bottlers sued Coke, claiming that Coke was obligated to sell Diet Coke syrups to the bottlers under the bottlers' existing contracts. In 1985, the bottlers filed a motion to compel Coke to produce its formulas for multiple drinks, including regular Coke and Diet Coke. The court granted the bottlers' motion, subject to a protective order, so that the court could determine whether the formula for Diet Coke was included in the range of formulas in the existing contracts. Coke refused to comply with the order, citing an overriding commercial importance in keeping its formulas secret. Coke acknowledged that it would be sanctioned for not complying with the order. In response, the bottlers requested that the court enter a default judgment in favor of the bottlers under Rule 37B of the Federal Rules of Civil Procedure, or FRCP. The bottlers also moved to have the court award the bottlers' costs and attorney's fees. Koch argued that the proper sanction should be a limited preclusion order and that the court shouldn't have awarded costs and attorney's fees.